Hey guys, MPTV, Matt Bob, Soccer Mental. Hope you're all well, thank you for joining me. Now, quite a long video today, so let me rush through this introduction bit. Today's video is all about this guy, Mr. Wilfred Ndidi, Leicester's star man this season, him, Marez Vardy, but Ndidi is the driving engine, CDM, breaks up play, anticipation, wins it, aggressive, can pass it, very good player. Now, today's video is all about him, but what I've decided to do, and I've wanted to do this for a long time, is start using some of the academy boys in some of the videos, so I can break a player's game down, like indeed it, but then I can do a training session one-on-one -on -one with one of my academy players to show you the things I think you should be working on to try and become more like a certain player, or play like a certain player. In this case, Wilfred indeed it. And the guy that I use today, great midfielder, one of my academy players, very similar position to Ndidi, passes it, wins it, anticipates it, is this guy. Karim Aburaya, centre midfield. So the first area we're going to look at, and I think Ndidi is one of the best in the Premier League at this already, is anticipation equals interception. Check your shoulder. If you have a quick check of your shoulder, it paints the picture in your mind what I always speak about. You know where a player behind you is moving. Then you look at the player with the ball, you can move into position, intercept and play. Let me take you to the board. So as you can see, got set up on the board. I lined up different coloured cones behind Kareem. Maybe you won't be able to see that on the video, it's too far away. I lined up different colours. The idea was me playing balls in and I would call out a colour so he has to check his shoulder to see which direction the pass is going. He then moves into position, intercepts the pass. Then I've got different positions set up, right back, right wing, second striker. With this second striker, I'd like him to play the ball in behind. So he's trying to get a strike, a runner in behind. This, is, this would be to feet, all right? Once he's intercepted the pass, then I call out left back, left wing, you get the drift. And then he has to play that pass as quickly as he can. The next area we look at is tackling. Ndide and Kareem, my player, are both very good at this. Really good. Understanding what position to get your body in when someone's attacking you, side on, low, when you feel you can win it. Be aggressive, go and win the ball. Tackle properly, come away with the ball and then play to the different players on the pitch. Try and move the ball quickly. This next training bit that we set up, I play, Kareem plays the ball into me and I attack him, I drive at him through midfield. He tries to win it, when he does, he plays quickly. This time, it wasn't me shouting out which positions to play it to, it was what he thought. What way is your body facing? Are you facing your left wing off? Give it him, as soon as you've won it. Are you facing your forward when you've just won it? Give it him, if he's in space. Good! Good! The last attribute I'm looking at today is the fade pass. Now, any of you that have watched my channel for a while or seen lots of my videos, you know how much I go on about the fade pass. It's a great passing football to have. It's where you strike through the ball with the laces just slightly off centre, sends the ball up and a loop 
and it fades out into someone's pass. This is a great pass to have in your repertoire as a footballer. Now the way we worked this into the session was pretty simple. There's two of us, so we set up a, a target where we want the ball to go through, but the ball's got to fade out. It can't be hit straight. Fade pass. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so what I want to do in here. One, two, one, two, on the shout, yes, open out, ball here, hit the fade, through that gap, looking for the right winger. Yes. Oh. Okay. Yep. Yep. Yes, that's the one. I looked up. Yes, a nice save. Well, you hit that pass in a match. Boom! You see the winger getting in. Well done, bro. Guys, I hope you've enjoyed the video. I hope you've got some things from it. Let me know if you like the fact that I use one of the players to show you how I would set up a training session to try and help you in certain areas. Um, big thanks to Kareem. Let me know in the comments below if you've enjoyed this setup and how I did it this time, broke down a Premier League players game and then tried to show you how to set a training session up to get a little bit closer to that player we was looking at. In this case, Wilfred Ndide. Guys, as always, thank you for watching. Listen, I'll see you guys all again very soon. Peace.